l'argomento della mia brevissimo intervento. The subject of my short contribution will relate to the Oviedo Sudarian. In Italy, the Oviedo Sudarian is known particularly for the morphological research carried out by the famous San Donardist Monsignor Ricci, which proved undeniable coincidence between the very bird uh, print on this uh, linen and the well uh, clear cut uh, which can be found in the uh, shroud face, the face of the, in, on the shroud. This was obtained, uh, these pr prints were obtained uh, by contact uh, in uh, different times uh, on the same uh, face uh, would allow to mutually identify the two relics, uh, I mean the Sudarian and the Shroud, which were kept uh, up to our times in two different places since they went through different paths and uh, known uh, from uh, different uh, ages and areas. So to make this uh, working assumption uh, certain, we are obliged to prove that the substance on the Oviedo uh, Sudarion, which uh, caused the imprints, uh, can be ascribed uh, to the presence of human blood uh, as the child in Turin. Why the results, uh, Max Weyer result as to the biological study are known, neither in the Congress in Syracuse in October 1987 where the uh, morphological exam was uh, spread by Pastor Rossello, nor in the suitable, in the ad hoc press conference convened by Rich in January 1989, there was any official confirmation of the presence of human blood on the relic in Oviedo. Considering the long silence uh, which surrounded the samples are uh, made uh, since uh, 1978, last year only, 1992, Monsignor Giulio Ricci gave me finally a fragment of the so Oviedo Sudarian with a specific mandate to look for possible presence of human blood. Since I'm a physician and hematologist, and so I used to work on fresh blood samples, I tried to overcome the difficulty represented by the application of research protocols on fragments of fabric, and I applied the following procedure. I was um, quite lucky because um, I had also the fragments of the linen, which for more than 400 years uh, was uh, in a position under the relic to be studied. So I carried out my research on the same, with the same uh, precise methods, not only on the fragment of the Oviedo Sudario, but also on the fragments of the cloth which supported that Sudario as I received it, and on the fragments of the cloth artificially soaked with human fresh blood. So. In, I tried uh, and uh, I could uh, realize uh, the positivity on the relic, uh, the very strong intensity on the linen, the soft weight water, and absolute negativity on fragments of the clo supporting cloth. <laughs> Respecting these uh, bases, uh, the screening test uh, resulted positive as well. The benzidine reaction was positive, positive with reservation and the uh, reaction to the um, reactive of my. Uh, the application of uh, known methods allowed me to find the presence of the crystals of acid hematines, attachment crystals, hematoporphyrin in uh, fluorescence, and this uh, was to hemoglobin. Really, the fibers treated with uh, uh, immunoserum allowed me to recognize the presence of human uh, hemoglobin, IgG with the fluorescence microscopy in light V. Few days ago, I re-examined the residues of the fragments of the Ovedia Sudariana, and I could demonstrate the presence of uh, glutinogen, typical of the A and B groups, through the tightening of the glutinating uh, power of anti A and anti B serums, which uh, proved the uh, fall of the uh, glutinating total. Could you ask him to slow down, please? He's reading something which we have not received. So, he didn't stress um, the presence of a uh, glutinin or an uh, anti-B. And uh, adhering to the relic, which believes like um, A and B blood, uh, 
element uh, to show it in the discussion i realized that uh, many people also remembering the analog analogous research uh, research programs on egyptian um, mummies um, could uh, find that uh, the last research uh, as um, kind of uh, evidence fact finding it is clear that uh, bacterial uh, pollutions uh, which i could find on the relic of the obeda sudarian can lie about the presence of uh, anti group uh, Agglutinate. While the uh, hemoglobin on the tissue could have kept the antigen, antigenic uh, power without keeping the uh, ability to act with specific antigens. I uh, would like to conclude by saying that the kind of research for the assessment of the blood group uh, is equal to what others made on the threads of the Shroud of Turin. All of this uh, is not only interesting from a relic and Point, uh, the point of view, but also from the point of view of shouts, because uh, in the prints, in prints can be overlapped, and on behalf of Monsignor Ricci, he wants to greet you all and express his congratulations. We make uh, this uh, Oviedo relic uh, authentic uh, we could also confirm mutually the authenticity of the shroud i think i found something which was studied by others uh, but was kept secret for a long time we do not understand why so i'd like to take uh, the occasion and the kindness uh, by the secretary and the chairman all organizers of this congress uh, and last but not least uh, or better the the Italian delegate, uh, Mrs. Maria Grazia Siato, because uh, if uh, studies, uh, more complete studies could be promoted uh, and finalized to the second, this second dry lake, probably also the, the um, shroud uh, question could be clarified. I have some slides with me supporting the research. We can show them or not according what, to what the moderator says. Very quickly, the uh, speaker is asking and saying, very quickly, because we are very, very late. I think it would be better to leave the floor to other speakers. So, thank you very much, um, Dr. Galloni. J'ai une information d'abord général. C'est pas possible. Excusez-moi, je m'en vais. Grand merci également. Merci beaucoup. Ah, le voir. Very quickly, this is the cloth which was for 400 years behind the Oviedon Sudarian, which was used to set up a negative standard and a positive one with the soft one, a millimeter paper, measurement paper. This is the aspect of the Oviedon Sudarian. This small fragment was given to me to carry out this research. This is the microscopic view, 55 magnifications is the Oviedo uh, shroud, um, very different cloth, um, different from the shroud. This is the stick test, uh, the center, in the center we have the sample, the negative doesn't have any coloration, coloring, the other one is a coloring for the positive test. This is the benzidine test. Uh, the center is uh, white is negative, positive is strongly brown, and the sample is uh, brown too. This is the Maya test. The center, we have a colored material. It is not at all red like the others. It's very, it's a 
background is strongly positive, but also the sample is uh, positive. And the same uh, test, to do test, uh, read the sample and read the artificially soaked uh, sample. Positive with a kind of reservation because we have a strong red coloring of small fragments. Ecco, yeah, yeah. Qui, abbiamo, uh, qui abbiamo i cristalli. Qui abbiamo i hematoporf acid, hematoporf in uh, crystals, which is typical of blood, and this is very decisive for searching for blood, for the presence of blood. In monoglobulin, this is bamboo cane uh, fibers of the linen of the Oviedo Australia, and this is a magnification. Spore, vegetal spore, and uh, bacter bacterial flora. This is the decrease in the title of uh, pure serum uh, there. And down you see 1640. There is a uh, uh, decrease in it. This is uh, the test for groups. You see glutenine. A uh, glutenine. A glutenate, nothing of this when we do not add the glutenin. A glutenin, this is for group A and group B. You see? Fibre pulite senza mezza glutinate, e mantiene qua. To prove group B. And that's it. Thank you very much, and um, I wish you a good uh, work.